We are at the beginning of a new quarter and I'm about to start working on a new course. This one is about web design. I am super excited about this. What's up and welcome to another week of wins and fails where I'm sharing my journey as an entrepreneur with you guys week by week. And this week, as we're starting off uh, July in a new quarter, it's the third quarter of 2019. I'm really excited to start working on a new course and it's going to be about web design. So some of you might know that I already have one course, which is basically my business right now. And it's a course that's teaching designers how to use Webflow. And the question that I get from a lot of my students is, all right, now we can build amazing websites with Webflow, but we want to know how to better better design them in sense of how do we do better art direction, better layout, better typography, better images, better animations. How do we make the websites more usable? How do we sell them to the clients? How do we, instead of working on a $1,000 website, we want to start working on $10,000 websites. And so I have a lot to say about this. You know, I've been building websites for over 15 years now. And so I think I have a lot to share and I want to help my students to design better websites. I also actually think that a lot of my audience, perhaps you guys, or I know a lot of people that are following me on Instagram as well, are very interested in doing better web design. Maybe not specifically working with Webflow. Some of them are working with other alternatives or, or they're even developers themselves. But so they might not want to work with Webflow, but they're very interested in learning how to do better web design. And so I think this course can really help a lot of people. And so I'm really excited to do this. It's actually almost one year exactly since I launched my first course. So it, I've spent the whole year basically, you know, just improving it and putting the systems in place. And now I'm starting to work on a new one. And it seems like I will be doing the, the way that I'll be working on it and launching it is I'm going to do the exact same thing that I did last year because it works so well for me. So basically the way that I'm going to structure it is going to work like this. This week I'm actually going to do a pre-sale which means I'm going to sell um, just a limited amount of um, seats in the beta course before I even launch it. Um, and I'm going to make this offer at a discounted price. And I think for uh, as a starting point, I'll only offer this to my current students. So just to have some people in the course when I'm creating it, those people in this beta group are going to help me, you know, make sure that I do the right content. They're going to go through it and give me feedback so I can improve it. And they're going to be kind of a better group for it. So I will do this little tiny limited amount of sale this week. Um, and then I'll spend the whole month of July to create the content and work together with the people in the better group to make sure that the content is good. I'm going to use, um, August, which is the next month to just improve the content and work on all the marketing, um, of how I'm going to sell this new course. So I'll probably need a new uh, landing page, a new sales page and uh, email funnels and all the things that you need when you're launching a new course. Um, so that's, that's a lot of work. It's almost sometimes as much work as creating the course content itself. And the goal here, I'm also going to kind of launch a new brand because right now I have a course, it's called the Webflow Masterclass. Now I'm going to have a new course. I'm not sure about the name yet, yet, but it's going to be about web design. And so I'm going to need kind of an, a brand that consists all of the courses that I ever make. Um, and that brand is going to be Flux Academy. So I've named it after, you know, this YouTube channel and my company. Um, so it's going to be called Flux Academy. I'm right now in the process of working on the brand of this new course, um, of this new school. I'm working with an amazing designer. Um, and we're going to launch that on August as well. So in August, I'm going to have to build a new website and launch that. <clears throat> so there's a lot of work around the, the marketing aspect of launching a new course. And then on September, I hope I actually know that by mid September, I have to launch this new course because at the end of the month, I'm flying away. Um, there's kind of like the holidays here in Israel and I'll be flying away for almost one month during the holiday season here in Israel. So I have to launch this and I don't want to launch this just like the day before I leave because that's actually what I did last year. Big mistake. You don't want to launch a new product, a new course, and then go on vacation the next day. You want to stay here. You want to support people. You want to make sure that everything works well. And so uh, I want to launch this at least two weeks before I'm leaving. So it's, I, 
right now in my calendar it's booked as i think it's between 12 and 14 of september i will be launching the new course so i'm very very excited about this i'll probably share a lot of content around web design and uh here on this youtube channel and on my instagram as well if you're not following on instagram there's great content coming up there so you want to make sure that you follow on instagram as well and that's it i hope this um that whether you are in my webflow masterclass right now or if you're not there but you're interested in web design you will check out this um, new course that's coming up i hope it will be helpful for you and i'm excited to do this if you want to make sure um, to tell me what what is interesting for you what would you like to learn make sure you leave that in the comment here because i read all the comments and this will also help me kind of inform the structure and the content that i'll put in the new course excited to take you on this journey of launching my second course so yeah it's going to be an exciting quarter see you on the next video